Hello guys, okay, we're back for part two. In part one we went through all the story and all that stuff and introduced the game, learnt the moves. Now we're going to get into the actual adventure and I'm actually going to start talking properly hopefully about this game rather than just learning stuff. Okay, this one's compulsory. You'd think someone would have questioned uh, the massive statue or like the massive carving of, of herself that's just been put into the mountain. Show us the way, bottle boy. Or fix the bridge so you can cross it. I'm going to give up on the accents as well, guys. And then to Gruntilda's lair. Look out for me inside. Good luck. Okay, here we go. Now the actual adventure begins. So yeah, this is... Oh god. Creepy music. Um... This is Banjo-Kazooie, it was released in 1998. For those of you that hadn't worked out by now based on the sto- oh. Yeah, who hadn't, used, who hadn't worked out based on the story, what was going on. Grunty's a witch. Uh, she steals- she wants to steal, um... Banjo's sister, Tute, and transform herself into being young, so she can be young. Oh, this is, uh, Klungo, by the way. This is Grunty's assistant. Hurry, Klungo, push that switch! I'm tired of being an ugly witch. But you are an ugly witch, miss. Uh, excuse me, by the way. If anyone heard that? Manjo! Oh dear. Oh. Here we go. There he is. The fun begins. My tricks and traps. We'll see who wins. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, so this is Banjo-Kazooie, um, when was this released? 98, so that would have been after Super Mario 64. I think this was Rare's attempt to kind of challenge Super Mario 64. Um, it's all about Banjo and Kazooie, a funny bear and the most sarcastic bird, uh, bird is an animal, not woman, uh, in the entire history of video gaming. Um, Grunty the Witch steals Banjo's sister Tootie, wants to steal her youth so that she can be young and pretty again and Banjo's got to save her by going through her lair going through all the different magical worlds that are inside her lair and collecting one of a da -da -da -da, many things there's I believe there's nine different items in this game you saw in the at the beginning there we have uh, honeycomb pieces which give you extra health honey which put your health back trophies which give you extra lives and then all this down the right hand side here you've got notes which you need to learn moves I want to say oh no no sorry no notes uh, unlock doors in Grunty's world so that you can get to more areas eggs which you can use as weapons red feathers which you can use to fly gold feathers which make you invincible skulls which allow you to well actually I'll explain gold skulls when we get one um, on the bottom there is Jinjo's you need, I believe if you get five of them in every world, you earn a Jiggy, and the Jiggy is, that's what is in the bottom right corner, they're jigsaw pieces, and they're like the equivalent of stars in this game. You need to get Jiggies, collect enough of them, um, I'm assuming collect enough of them so you can access the next world, I want to say. Yeah, I can't fully remember the breakdown of it, something like that. You need Jiggies, Jiggies are the most important thing in this game, and here's one of them. Here's the first one. Hey, it's me, Mr. Jiggy. Now go and find a picture with a piece missing. Okay, right, so you need to collect Jiggies to... I love the intro. I love the music in that. I just wanted to shut up for it for a second. I love how Kazooie eats the Jiggies as well, so she's going to get fat pretty fast by the time we finish this game. So yeah, you need Jiggies to enter, extra, enter new worlds. So every time you find a new world, you'll find a picture. Actually, uh, can we change to the camera here? So yeah, you'll find a picture, I'm assuming a bit like this, uh, and there'll be a piece missing, a jigsaw piece missing, and you have to get enough jigsaw pieces to... to complete the picture. And once the picture's completed, you can open up the new world, and you can enter that world and find more jiggies, and etc, etc. So this is world one, I presume. Where are we going? Okay, over here. Right, okay, so this is, the, this is a nice, easy intro. So, Mumbo's Mountain. You found a jigsaw picture. Stand on the jigsaw shaped... Okay, here we go, yeah. And so there's only one piece missing. We only need one jiggy. 
fill in the missing spaces with the jigsaw pieces, yeah. We've got the first jigsaw piece, go go boy. Great! To fill in the missing spaces on a picture, press A. If you don't want to use any jigsaw pieces, press B to leave. Well, I didn't want to use it. So we've completed the picture, so now the world opens. Mumbo's Mountain! That was such an easy fit! The others may just test your wit! You're gonna have to get used to this, she rhymes. Everything she says is a rhyme. Okay, welcome to World 1, Mumbo's Mountain! There are three new moves to learn in this world. Find my molehill, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's fine. Okay, I, I can't remember if there's 10 jiggies per world. I want to say 10 jiggies per world. Let's start killing bitches. Okay, notes. I have a note, one of a hundred on each world. Collect us to open the note doors. And this is a Jinjo. See, we're just rocking it here, guys. Gruntilda has imprisoned five of us Jinjos on each world. Free us all to get a Jiggy, yeah. So collect five from each world and you'll get one of the ten Jiggies. I'm, I'm almost certain there's ten Jiggies per world. Uh, you kind of pretty much... <laughs> this game is pretty linear, the first one. The second one is definitely not, but we won't worry about that until we get to it. Uh, if we do a, if I, unless I get bored of this so fast that I don't want to do a Let's Play of Banjo Tui. Oh, this guy doesn't die. Right. Uh, these guys release health, I want to say. Oh, okay, I kind of just killed them, but yeah, I'm pretty sure they release health. Okay. Yeah, this game is very linear, so really you're not going to have to do a lot of backtracking in this game. So every time you enter a new world, you might as well pretty much try and go for everything you can in one go. So get all the jig, uh, get all of the uh, notes. Uh, I should actually point out the eggs, the the eggs and the feathers are not compulsory; they're just weapons. So you don't have to go, try and collect every single one. But the notes, collect every note you can, every jinjo, every jiggy, uh, every skull. Everything else is a nice little extra. The honeycomb pieces are an extra as well. Uh, I'm going to talk to Mole Boy first. What have we got here? The Talon Shot will let Kazooie tackle steep... Yes, now this is a really important move. How does she do it? Uh, hold the right trigger, then press the left trigger. Continue to hold the right or left trigger whilst moving. So, this is a really good move. So, this isn't... this. this I, do, I think this kind of isn't a good example, but uh, because it doesn't look that steep, but you're going to need this to get up steep hills in the game. And fucking, I can't... Ah, uh, here we go. Egg. Right, eggs. Weapons. I'm pretty sure we need to learn a move to use these eggs. That's another ginger! Right. Anything else in behind these? Yes, okay, right, now these are the Mumbo Skulls. Uh, right, I'll provide an explanation here. Mumbo's token, sorry. Use for Mumbo's magic. So, the name of this world is called Mumbo's Mountain, but basically, actually, I'm going to click the first Jiggy. You must search, yes, I was right, for ten of us on each world. We'll help you progress through the witch's lair. Um, hey, got treatment! Oh, I can't do it on her. Stand on the exit pad. When you're ready to, leave, um, I think that said when you're ready to leave, stand on the exit pad. I was going to press, the, I pressed the middle button, uh, expecting it to bring up the achievement, but of course, technically we're on the 360. Um, so yeah, so it says Mumbo's Mountain, but this isn't the only place you're going to meet Mumbo. Um, he's in most worlds. Basically, you need to collect a certain number of skulls in each world, and then give them to Mumbo. And when you give them to him, he'll transform you into a certain type of creature and you're going to need that creature to, to do something in, uh, in the world. You've collected enough notes to break the first note door. So, okay, right. Good to know. But we're going for all of them, Bottles! Yeah, his name's Bottles, isn't it? Uh, I do apologise, guys, if it feels like I'm do if I end up doing a lot of backtracking. Um, I just don't want to forget anything. I'm going to leave the monkey boy uh, until a little bit later. I want to see. I want to get. I want to try and do this in order. Collect all of the easy ones first. 
Uh, and kind of build from there. I mean, look, I can see the fourth Shinjo down there, so there's only one more to find. As you'd expect, this is very straightforward for now, guys, is, uh, but it gets a m much harder. If I'm quick, I might get this whole world done in one, in one, just one episode, but the, oh, shoot, I forgot about this chicky. But, uh, the others might take multiple, well, they will take multiple parts to do. Um, it's such a good game, I feel so nostalgic playing this game, and playing it on the Xbox One with high definition, uh, in insanely good quality, just awesome, oh, I can see bottles again. I don't know what these purple things are supposed to be, but they suck. Okay, this is uh, this is Mumbo's skull. This is where Mumbo lives. Um, so whenever you see one of these, then you know that Mumbo is in this world, and there and therefore there are skulls to collect. Okay, Eighty-five. So fifteen more hidden somewhere here, right there. We Juju, Mumbo's totem pole. Feed us with nice. Blue set. Okay, Bean, they want eggs. Okay, that's the third one already. I'm actually questioning. Because it feels like I've covered most of this world already. And yet there's, we've only got three jig uh, jiggy so far. Beak Buster. Jump into the air, then press the right or left trigger to send Kazooie. Ah, okay, right, fine now. Don't like the sound of that, Banjo. Bang. Oh, actually, right, yes, we need this to... So, bang. Ah! So, I'm presuming... That was pretty loud. Sorry, guys. Assuming we're going to get all the notes from here. Our uh, eggs. I'm... I'm assuming the last move in this world is to learn how to fire eggs, since we're starting to collect eggs. Oh, bullshit. Of course, actually, no, it must be. Ah, here we go, right. That's, ooh, that's all five jiggy. Uh, Jinjo, sorry, so now we can get the jiggy. That's four. Okay, extra life. I do apologize if my voice sounds a bit quiet, guys. Oh, and another one. That was easy. Five. Hold on, where is where's the where's the last ten notes then? Hmm. Okay. Probably done this in the wrong order, but fuck it, let's just go in uh, anything in back here. Nope. Yeah, I don't if my uh, mic sounds quiet at any point guys, I do apologise. Ah, more Hello Mumbo. Oh, we need five skulls? What? Me, Mumbo, best shame. Oh, he doesn't speak English. Help find a thiefy feathered one. No one likes Kazooie. Watch it, hot boy. Mumbo's magic tokens hid by which? Find tokens and Mumbo help you. Banjo not got enough. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Shut up, Mumbo. Look at sign. <laughs> Look at sign. Need five, bitch muffin. Can I get on the roof? Okay, so... I'm only in the first level, guys, and I've already screwed up uh, the order in which you have to find these. If it gets really bad, I'll probably look at a wiki or something. So, how do I give them eggs? Where's friggin' bottles? So I can learn this last move. In here? Okay, I think this is what we need, uh... I think this is what we need, uh... Mumbo to transform us into. I think we need him to... Oh, my God. Yeah, we need Mumbo to turn us into a spider so we can get up here. I wonder if they're hidden in the trees. No. Um. Eh. The only place I haven't checked is over by the monkey. Shit. Ok, 
Okay, his voice is cold. Oh shit. Oh, Conga! That was pretty self explanatory. Congo's gold! That's my gold! Hey, that's friggin. that's uh, fucking Diddy Kong! Oh, it looks like Diddy. Chimp hungry, what's orange now? Feed Chimpy. Uh, what do I do? Ah! Is that enough, monkey? Do you want more? Are you satisfied? Chimpy help fat bear and bird. Oh my god, okay, well now this is just proven to be easy. Okay, three to go. Ah, here we are, right, right, right. Now we can learn how to fire eggs. Time for the buzzard to learn the ancient ways of the egg. The ancient ways of the egg. <laughs> Hold the right or left trigger, then press Y to shoot an egg out of your arse. I mean mouth. Press B instead of then you can shoot them out from Oh yeah you go, I was right from your ass. Sounds painful. I wish I'd never asked. Bird Bean can carry a hundred eggs in her backpack at one time. You can also use the left stick to aim. Egg sighting, huh? Oh thank you. Okay, five bottles. See you in the next world. He's in, uh, you'll, you'll learn a lot of moves in most of the world. Oh, hello, what have we got here? What's this day? Ah! I'm assuming that's one of the ten... Oh yeah, that's a good point. I'm pretty sure, uh, as well as the ten, uh, ten jiggies per world, there's also ten hidden throughout her lair. So that one we got, I'm pretty sure we have to fight this guy. Oh shit, okay, that's firing out my ass. I don't oh shit, I've forgotten how you fire them. Shit, uh, bottles. How do you fire them out of your mouth? Fire an egg out of Kazooie's mouth, hold the right or left trigger, then pre oh, press Y, okay. And then you press B, okay, fine, yeah, fine. Thank you. Die, bitch, die! Oh, he's pissed, oh, he's pissed! Do I, can I not hurt him? What do I do? Damn it, he just... God, you can't dodge those attacks! Ah, you missed, bitch. Yeah, you beat, bitch. Give me your jiggy. Thank you. I came out of his ass as well. Jeez, there's a lot of ass cracks in this game. Okay, so I presume there's. Oh, he's pissed again. I presume there's two more then in this world, because unless that one outside the world, it, it counts as being part of Mumbo's Mountain. Actually, no, it can't be, because, yeah, I've just realised. We've got the... the token things. Or the, the Mumbo target things. Oh my god, what the hell was that? How do I do? There we go. Oh, okay, and it gets faster and faster. I'm giving the jiggy, right, okay, now let's turn into... Let's go to Mumbo, turn into the spider, and then I'm assuming... The far, last five notes plus the jiggy... Well, definitely the jiggy, but I'm assuming the last five notes as well. Uh, at the top of the spider's layer. 
Oh, Thanos oh, Golden Press Ecstasy, Mighty Mumbo Magic. I do hope every I do apologize guys, I hope every not every one of these episodes is gonna be 20 plus minutes long. I just wanted to see if I could get all uh all the G's in this. Oh, Mumbo Jumbo, a trade bag! Not bad for first, I kind of cut him off a bit at the end there. Not bad for first magic. I'm assuming he's supposed to say. Yeah. Oh, help. God, this is fucking steep ass. Oh, this camera angle there. Bingo! Okay, that's all the notes. If I fall off. Hmm. Pretty funny. Bingo! Okay, let's not fuck up here. Alright, good, good, good. Around the corner. Bingo! And that's all 10 jiggies, guys. So let's get out of here quickly. Let's change back. Get out of the world and then we'll end. Part. Uh, part 2. World 1. Forgot about that lovely music. Change me back, bitch. I want to be a bear again. I mean, I'd rather be a human, but, you know. Of Spartan. But if we have to be a bear, so be it. <laughs> so good this game! Uh, oh yeah, it's probably a good idea to walk around like this because you'll get around like 10 times faster. Let's get out of here! Bingo! Here we good. When you open a world door, baddies escape. Oh, don't tell me! Oh, for fuck's sake. I need to be the spider. God damn it. Okay, right, well, join us next time, guys, when uh, I'll come back here as a spider and we'll get this last jiggy. But yeah, we've, uh, the totals. Oh, yeah, so yeah, there's 10 jiggies hidden in Gruntilda's lair. 100, we've got every. Oh! Didn't get any honeycomb. So there's honeycomb pieces hidden in the world. I might go back and get them as well. Okay, guys, uh, we'll see you guys next time for part three. Ta ta!